Let me come to you, Honorable Lasso Yusuf. Last election, you were in APC, and you grew to becoming a deputy speaker in Nigeria of the House of Representatives. How do you explain your fallout with some of the leaders of the APC? Are you desperate to be a sure state governor? Simple. Leaders that are vindictive, wicked, and don't allow other people to grow. I was told to my face in 2015 by somebody who I will not mention his name on camera that if I did not listen to them, my future depends on it. I don't know how somebody will say my future depends on something he wants to collect from me. So they are vindictive, they are wicked. I'm not desperate. When I lost the primary in 2018, despite the fact that it was surrounded by controversy, people have suddenly forgotten that the issue of direct and indirect primary in Nigeria, in APC, started because they wanted to prevent Lasso to become governor of Osho State. And the, the fight between Arik Peshola and Oyetola is traceable to the fact that I was denied to, to get the ticket of APC in 2018. They are only dodging. And so I'm not desperate. But this one, I'm going to win it. Let me silence, please. Silence. Silence. Let me do a silence, please. There have been a lot of um, silence in the auditorium, please. There have been a lot of frenzy, especially on social media, since the emergence of Mr. Peter Ubi and uh, Senator Yakubu Dati as the candidate and the vice presidential candidate of your party, Labour Party, there is this popular saying, obedient. Now, considering that your party in Northern State cannot bo boast of such a very good structure politically compared to some others, do you think the Peter Obi effect will help your cause? So, this Northern State, they know me here. Yes, I would like Peter Obi to be associated with me, but the people of Osho State, they know me. Where I have stayed, where I've run for elections, I became the deputy speaker. And people call me different names, depending on which direction you are calling from. I'm the Kolaba of Ilobu, they call me Kolaba. People call me ATM, people call me Darek. But so everybody, they know me. So I don't need that external phone. Let me tell you, it's delusional for politicians to think there are just two people running for governorship. I'm going to win it. I know it. They know it. All right. They know it. Thank so, you. So, social media, yes, but I've taught the new campaigning of Osho State. Remember when I said in 2018, when, when I said in 2018 that if I don't get, if I didn't get involved in that election, APC was not going to win. APC did not win. Ashiwajibola Ahmed Tinubu in 48 hours called me five times with Obadi Koro's phone, begged me to come and work with them. All right, thank you so much. Senator.